My fellow Americans, my name is Stephanie Pressman with Red Carpet Report, and I'm here at the world-famous Dolby Theater in Hollywood to announce my candidacy to interview the cast and creative team of HBO's hit show, Veep. There will be no more questions. Thank you. Actually, there will be more questions because I'm going to interview them, so that's kind of how it works. Come on. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm good. I'm Stephanie. Stephanie, how are you? I'm great. So, Ben, <laughs> our like lovable little depressed Ben. Yes. Is there anything that's going to make you happy, perhaps in St. John's work? Uh, I don't know if Ben will ever be happy. I mean, he is moment to moment sometimes, uh, but he's a political junkie and and his president is, is uh, giving a, he's going to resign in a year. So Ben is kind of in a panic mode to uh, ingratiate himself to someone and to try to find work. Do you so, think he is going to join Selena's team this season? I think he's going to make every effort to, to make himself uh, uh, useful and, and uh, important to their campaign. Did you know a lot about politics before you came in on this show? Uh, well, sure. I'm, I've always been kind of a political junkie. Um, and it's just kind of watching how the sausage is made in a humorous way. Um, but no, nothing really surprised me. I mean, the writing is fabulous and it's, it's, it's so funny, but nothing really about politics that I wasn't aware of, you know. Did you guys get a chance to go into the White House and meet with anybody, shadow anybody? Well, I came in last season uh, and I auditioned for a, a two-episode two, uh, arc and ended up on the show. So it was just, audition came in and then they said stick around. So, no, I didn't really, uh, uh, didn't really shadow anyone, or, um, but it's all around you, you know, and the writing is great, so it's not like... Uh, it's it's all given, and there's people on the show like with Frank Rich on the show. Everybody's very politically savvy. You can bounce stuff off them, so it's well, all pretty he, much contained. Very, and they're on top of everything. They know, you know. So we have a lot of nourishment in terms of material and and what's what. Well, I'm a big fan of your career. One of the earliest roles I can remember is from Ghostbusters. <laughs> One of my first jobs. That was a long, long time ago. What was that like working on that project? Uh, it was pretty quick. Uh, I think it was. Uh, I think it was while we were doing Dave with Ivan Reitman, and he was working uh, on Ghostbusters too. And I went in and just did a. I think that was two days uh, with Bill Murray and, and uh, Chloe Webb. It was fun. Well, it was fun to watch. Yeah. Big part of my my childhood and growing up. Mm -hmm. um, the whole Harold Ramis passing, did you get a chance to work with him at all on set then, or have you had any other chances? He directed a pilot that Gary starred in um, that was wonderful, and so I got a chance to work with him on that. Um, yeah, it was just sad, of course. I mean, he, he's just a very gifted, you know, actor and writer and director, and, you know, they always, those things always knock you off your feet. You don't expect it. And, you know, you look forward to kind of what they're doing next or what they're directing next or what they're writing next. And so you're going to miss a lot of things that they would have done that would be memorable. So, yeah. Well, what can we look forward to with season three on Veep and with Ben? Well, uh, on season three, I think it's just really opens up because Selena's out on the road and she's looking for support. She wants to uh, test the waters for a presidential run. So she has a lot more people to mess up around, and we're going to be scrambling quite a bit to make sure she's okay. Well, thank you so much. You're welcome. My fellow Americans, I hereby deny anything that happened today. I had no knowledge of any of it. But if you liked this video, make sure you click like. If you want to see more videos like this one, please click subscribe. And don't forget to leave a comment in the comment box below telling us if you were running for office, what's the first thing you would change or make a new law or anything like that. We'll see you next time here at Red Carpet Report. <laughs> I'm a huge fan. Is there any advice you have for other actresses out there? Keep plugging away, I guess. You know, it's not easy, but if you really love it, just stick to it.
Well, congratulations. You've had such a successful career. Thank We're looking you. forward to what Selena does from Thank here you. on. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.